Hey guys, Dr. Jackie with Athletes Potential. I'm going to go over the chop and lift. So these are great rotational and stability exercises that we like to do with patients. And all you need is a small band. And again, something sturdy to put it on. So make sure you put it on um, a pole in the gym or something on your deck perhaps, but don't put it on something that can move because we're pulling on it, we don't want it to fall over on you. All right, so we'll start with the chop first. So for the chop, I'm going to have the band a little higher. I want to get in a half kneeling position here. So half kneeling. The foot that's closest to the band is going to go up. I want you to grip the band with both of your hands. And then from here, you're going to pull down and across your body to your opposite hip. I can actually move this band up a little bit. Go there. So I'm going to start across, chop down my hip, and back up. Down my hip, and back up. So you might tend to want to hunch over a little bit. You might get tired. So as you're kneeling, you really want to stay in that upright posture as you pull across. So some people might start to get here. Really squeeze your booty, stay tall. So just for the sake of the video, I'm going to switch legs to show you the lift. So for the lift, you want it to be low. So we're going to have it low on the pole. The leg opposite the pole is now going to be up. So now I'm working the other side. All right, I'm going to grip it down here at my hip. Same thing, staying nice and tall, ribs over pelvis. I'm going to lift up and across. Go up and across. Good. So you notice most of the movement is coming from my arms. I don't want a ton of rotation here or falling forward. So nice stacked torso, up and across. All right, go ahead and give that a try. <laughs> 